bonsai. This is number 19, Japanese maple series. Tree number 19. This one's got a really nice nabari setting up and it's got it's a very small really good taper over a very short distance it's like what is it 25 centimeters or something fantastic tree the leaf size has come way down so it's really pretty uh, i just need to keep kind of clipping it back and refining it tops looking pretty good so we'll just give it a quick slip over starting from the top this time. Basically I just want to short, shorten the leaf back before they get too big and fat and coarse. I probably should have come in and started and just pinched all the tips as soon as they came out on this one because it's so beautifully vigorous. Bit of wire in there, what's that going on? It's holding that branch down. It's all good, I think we're okay. So that's my front. Don't really need that little piece in there. I need to keep the light getting in the into this inside here too, otherwise I'll lose the growth in here. This is a fantastic tree. Lots and lots of ramification. Lots and lots. So I've been pruning these really hard and leaf stripping them and pushing them right back and probably only advancing them in like a centimetre a year <laughs> um, to get that trunk nice and tapered, get all that thickness in the trunk. Probably pushing them a bit hard really but um, that was my loss for of growth, not, not quality of the tree. Quality of the tree has actually improved the quality of the trunk anyway. So all these trees are for sale. If you go to Achievements and Bonsai, they're listed there. Don't know what this one's listed at, but the price on this one was going to go up because it's such a good tree. In fact, I will name it right now as being Ooh. it's funny, eh? Just make up the price on the spot. It's kind of like, well, how much do I want to hang on to it and keep working on it? How much do I just want to flick it on so I can, you know? Keep improving my setup here. I think I'll call that one like a $1,200 tree.